Hey, what's up? I'm John from The Lawn Yop Show, and welcome to today's crazy news, where we bypass the big mainstream headlines and do the trash news, man. That's what I call it. The crazy, bizarre, and viral stories of the day. Today's crazy news, you can find it on bitshoot.com under uh, the Lan Yob Show channel, as well as YouTube under the Lan Yob Show channel, and on its own channel, Today's Crazy News, at rumble.com. We'll do one story headlines that you'll see in the thumbnail, but we'll cover several different stories. And don't forget, all the stories you see, including the videos, will have the links in the description. Let's get to it. Got some viral videos that we're going to get to before we get into the news stories. This first one is about a kid's zipline ride getting interrupted. It got stopped. So let's full screen it. By the way, this is from video.storyful.com. And uh, if we can full screen it here. And you go. No break. Look me too loud all right cool oh he don't hit worry, something don't worry don't worry, don't worry. He just yeah i just clocked it straight in the face oh. oh what did i do about the sloth don't, don't worry don't worry he said no break you gotta hit the break look at him what are you doing what are you doing up here uh -oh. Oh, my rope. Get off my rope, Ew, man. It's, 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 <laughs> this is my vine. Did Don't worry. He's going to hurry up and move out the way. And you go. <laughs> no break. Look me. All right. So it repeats there. So, okay. That's a little viral video. Again, uh, credit Go Adventure Arena Park. And it's on Storyful. Got another one from Storyful. Another kind of viral video here let's full screen it and this one the story behind this one is there's a toddler crying on a plane and instead of complaining about it the uh, passengers do something else and i don't want to get blown away by volume so let's start it lower <laughs> Okay, cool. So that's nice. They sing uh, the Baby Shark song to the kid, hopefully trying to quiet him down. We got another video to watch here, viral video, before we get into a few news stories, including that crazy, demented dentist. Dun, dun, dun. All right, what do we have here? Uh, this is about a TikTok guy or TikToker in England. That's what they call him now. He's been getting a lot of uh, hits because he does his bulldog challenges. Uh, challenges with his bulldog right here. You see him. Uh, he puts two rows of treats on the kitchen floor. Okay. I don't want to get blown away by music or whatever again. And uh, then he gets down next to the pup and they race to see who eats the most. All right. Let's see. Oh, wait, let's start again, let's start again. Right. So I've been practicing. And me and Pablo are going to have a race. Why are you so focused? We're going three. One. Two. Three. <laughs> Smoke. Oh, and he ate his too. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Look, mine, and a last piece. That was great. <laughs> the dog finished up before him, and he ate his treats. There you go. What was his name? Pablo? I forget. I don't know. Go ahead. That was cool, dude. All right. Uh, got a, a, a story here. I kind of heard about this. I just wanted to show you. It's actually happening. This one from Lad Bible uh, or LAD Bible. I, I, I don't, what is it called? Lad Bible? LAD? Anyways, they say uh, the Global Hatcher Mall in Shanghai has installed husband pods. That's right. Men can enter the pods and watch TV or play video games while their wives shop. 
It looks like this is all in Chinese, so we're probably not going to understand what they're saying here. Um, the glass pods are soundproof, they say, and temperature controlled. So they just chill, play video games, watch TV while the wife uh, shops. Can't beat that. Except maybe if they give you a little uh, bourbon or whiskey or something to drink, then you're all set, man. All right, got a couple more stories. Women's UTI was actually a glass tumbler, they say. A shot glass that was lodged in her bladder for four years. Hmm, how did it get there? You remember I did a similar story about this. A guy had a tumbler that they found in his, his colon, I believe it was. And he claimed he swallowed it. And the doctors are like, bruh, that's impossible. That is impossible. <laughs> you can't. It's not going to fit down there. There's only one way for that to go in. Well, he was a male. This is a woman. So the story coming from the New York Post, this is a woman in Tunisia. 45-year-old, she showed up at the ER, and doctors thought she had a, un a urinary tract infection. Obviously, it was something more serious. When they scanned her abdomen, they realized she had a shot glass lodged inside the bladder. It had been there for four years. Uh, there's a photo of the thing after they removed it. They say, let's see if we can find it here. Oh, that's it. The glass didn't break, although it looked like there's a little chip here. Yep, it was intact, except for the chip, they say. How did it get there? Well, you know, she admitted it. She used she used it in the bedroom. Uh, <laughs> obviously, it took some effort to get it that high up in there and lodged. The glass was encased by a three-inch wide bladder stone that formed around it. So that's what that is. Surgeons were able to remove the stone and the shot glass, and she was out of the hospital in two days. Yikes. All right, and our headline, you remember Isaac Yankum DDS? Were you a big pro wrestling fan? I was growing up as a kid. There was a guy, I think he's the one that eventually became Kane, you know, the Undertaker's brother, Kane. But he, he was the demented dentist, Isaac Yankum. DDS, and his theme music was the worst wrestling theme music of all time because it was just drill sounds of somebody drilling. He just, right? And that was his theme music. So imagine, at this time, it was real big, and they would sell out. So an arena of 53 or 72,000 or whatever, and they just pipe that through the loudspeakers as loud as it goes. He's walking to the ring, and all you hear is, it's the thing, nightmares. I mean, ah, my teeth hurt. Just, just remembering that thing. Worst theme song of all time. Well, this story reminds me of him, except this guy is real, man. You know, it always seems like you're being tortured at the dentist, and they're not trying. Most of them are nice, but except for this guy who's doing it on purpose. This is coming from JS Online, the Milwaukee Journal Sentinel. Dentist in Wisconsin is facing up to 20 years in prison for cracking his patient's teeth on purpose purpose so he could charge them more money his name is scott chormoli he's 61 and he apparently he's been doing it for years he wasn't caught until he sold his practice in 2019 the new owners were looking through his records and things didn't add up the average dentist in wisconsin does about six crowns for every 100 patients good old scott chormoli isaac yankum he was averaging 32 crowns per 100 patients. He'd lie and uh, claim an x-ray showed a crack in their tooth, and he'd use his drill to actually crack it. And then he would take more x-rays and use those pictures to give to the insurance to justify the crowns. He billed more than $4.2 million between 2016 and 2019, and that was just for installing crowns. So it's not clear how long he'd been doing it, but he had been in practice since 1986. The jury convicted him last week on five counts of fraud, two counts of making false statements. He'll be sentenced in June. Almost 100 former patients are suing him. 
and they did obviously suspend his license. And, man, you can't trust anybody now. I'm so skeptical when I go to the dentist. You know, I never like to go to the doctor because I'm like, man, they're going to find something wrong with me. Uh, or, or you can just go to the dentist, and they'll make something wrong with you <laughs> like this guy here. Hey, folks, uh, if you like this video, give us a like. If you want other people to see it, obviously share it. You want to see more, subscribe. I appreciate it, and uh, don't forget, links in the description. We'll do this again soon. Thanks for watching.